We're back with Planet 1051's Mikey and the Misses. Uh, this one is from Caden. Hi, Hi Caden. He says, my dad's a sneeze yeller. Ooh. So he, ah, ah! Okay. Like yeah. one of those. Uh-huh. Yeah. Which is? My dad's a German sneezer. What is a German sneezer? His Every single one of his sneezes sound like a German word. Ayika! <laughs> or, baby. or is yeah. that Russian? Ayika! I don't know. Every single no one sounds like a word. Cool. Okay. This one is from Nikki. Hi, Hi Nikki. Nikki. Says he cracks his jaw multiple times a day. That's me. You do that. Mm-hmm. You got the TMJ thing going yeah, I on. I just did it. Did you just hear it? No. Yep. Yeah, I was too busy talking. This one is from Trisha. Hi, Hi Trisha. Trisha. Says we could never turn our backs on dinner because he would take away or add something each time. That's my dad to a T. Really? Oh, yeah. He did it all the just time. Constantly hiding food. Yes. You've done this to our kids. Yeah, I got it from my dad. There you go. It's yeah. a legacy. Yeah. This one is from Angie. Hi, Hi Angie. Angie. Says my dad is weirdly flexible. Like he can wow. do the splits flexible. Flexible. It's a wow. little disturbing. You know, when a mom does it, you're like, oh, must have been cheerleader. Yeah. When a dad can do it's the different. splits, yeah, yeah. it is different. It's impressive. Especially when it's in front of your friends. This one is from Jeanette. Hi, Hi Jeanette. Jeanette. Said uh, he's had a mustache for almost 40 years. Wow. We, you know, when something works. It's true. And then when they shave it off, you're like, Who's who that are you? Yeah, you've yeah. probably seen those videos of dads with mustaches. They shave them off and the kid just starts screaming. Oh, they're like, who I is this? Seen that. And it just creeps them out. <laughs> so 40 years. Hey, when you got that soup strainer and it looks good, it looks good. This one is from Annika. Hi, Hi Annika. Annika. <laughs> he catches the stray cats in our neighborhood and drops them off outside of the city. Is that like, legal? Like at the city pound? No, like in the wilderness outside the city. This seems cruel. I'm sure the dad has probably thought well, of the survival of these cats. Well, yeah, but also, isn't it kind of dangerous not knowing yeah. what diseases they carry? And I don't know. Hey, and how do you know it's a stray cat? Just because it doesn't have a tag doesn't that's mean true. it's an- Annika, we're not going to rat out your dad. But maybe you need to have a little intervention with him. Maybe. Maybe. He uses the same greeting every time I call. What does it? (laughs) This is from Harrod. That's awesome. What does it? Okay. What does it? I'm going to use that the next time somebody gives us a call. This one is from Kim. Hi, Hi, Kim. Kim Kim says that her dad would dress up like Phil Collins in the 80s to help me impress my friends. (sighs) Yeah. If that's, you already look awesome. like Phil Collins, yeah. you might as well do something with it. Uh, yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah. I would lose my mind. Yeah. If I thought the Phil Collins was in my neighborhood in the <laughs> 80s. Hey, kids, what's up? Yeah. Or no. Hey, hey, kids, what does it? You like Genesis? <laughs> and then uh, finally, this one comes from Mac. Hi, Hi Mac. Mac. He says he once made a pair of pants out of old shoes. Mm. I can't picture it. I have I no I idea how, how this works. Yeah. Mac, we need pictures. Yeah. And instructions. <laughs> I mean, this this sounds absolutely fantastic. Cool. Oh, you know, we've got... <laughs> this is one more. Oh, okay. Uh, this one comes from Jackie. Hi, Hi Jackie. Jackie. It says, my dad scratches his back on every corner wall he can find. Hmm. Like a bear. Yeah, yeah like a bear. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty freaking awesome. Yeah. We want to know about your weird dad. Let us know. Send us a text, 435-674-1051, and you may hear about your weird dad right here on the radios. This one comes to us from Stacy. Hi, Hi Stacy. She says, he buys popsicles with the jokes on the stick and then calls all of us to read the jokes. Yeah. That's I love awesome. That. that is cool. That is but very yeah, cool. But yeah, I mean, it is weird. Yeah. yeah. Sure. Well, she says he's also diabetic, and we're like, maybe that's not the best thing for him to eat. Mm. Um, maybe that, that's why he has the kids do most of it. That, yeah. That's true. But that, that sounds like something that everybody's going to miss one day. Yes. Is getting those calls and those jokes. So yes. No matter how corny they are, just keep in mind that it's pretty awesome. Uh, This one comes from Dawson. Hi, Hi, Dawson. Dawson. Said my dad's name was Steve. He had this way of pulling in his bottom lip, 
making his upper front teeth stick out like a beaver. Okay. And he would call himself Beaver Steve. Yeah. Beaver That's Steve. Really cool. That's really cool. Long live Beaver Steve. We love it. This one is from Daniel. Hi, Hi Daniel. Daniel. He says, my dad collected guns and cannons. We'd hear fire in the hole from the backyard, and we all had to duck. <laughs> he says, my friends were convinced that he was the Unabomber. Oh, wow. Sure. That's awesome. That is really, really yeah. weird and absolutely wonderful at the same time. This one is from Tammy. Hi, Hi Tammy. Tammy. He said, he used to mow the lawn and cut off shorts so short that the pockets would hang out. Yeah. Yeah. When you got it, you I, got it. Well, I've I've seen some dads doing this, and they do it purely to embarrass their children. Absolutely. Yeah. Love it. And, uh, you know, if it was like the 80s, 90s, that's where it was at. Yeah. The cut off shorts and yep. no shirt. This one comes to us from Joe. Hi, Hi Joe. Joe. He says, he sings O Canada while he goes to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, Canada, our home and native land. Ev- every time? Wow. Uh, maybe he's trying to cover up some sounds. I don't maybe know. Maybe he just loves Canada. I don't know. The question is, does the rest of the family have to stop what they're doing and put their hand on their heart? I have no idea. Is that what they do in Canada when they sing that? I don't know. I have no idea. Okay. So that's why I've got a bunch of different questions. Okay. I don't even know if the family's Canadian. This is Utah. All right. Here's the next one. This one is from Ian. Hi, Hi Ian. Ian. He says he can tell what year a map was made by seeing where the country lines are. Oh, that's awesome. That's not weird so much as really cool. That is like, really cool. That's showing that you're really smart. Yeah. Once again, if you're just joining us, these are questions. What makes your dad weird? And uh, send us a text, 435-674-1051. You could win a party over at Big Shots Golf. This one, let's see here. This one is from Hannah. Hi, Hi Hannah. Hannah. All of his tools are Milwaukee brand, and he refuses to use anything that's not red. When you find your brand, wow. you know, he's a, he's a Milwaukee guy. I know, he likes but Milwaukee like, tools. But are all Milwaukee tools red? Yes. Okay. So that's his thing. Yeah. I don't know if the, he doesn't touch things that aren't red, like for the rest of his life, or just when he's fixing things. Okay. But hey, he's a Milwaukee man. And he's OCD. Okay. There you go. <laughs> And finally, this one is from Julie. Hi, Hi Julie. Julie. He says he wears jeans when he goes jogging. Love it. <laughs> you know, when somebody Now, if that's in the <laughs> middle of the summer, I love it. Yeah. When somebody's just jogging in shorts, you're like, hey, there's a jogger. Yeah. Some guy's running full speed on the sidewalk wearing shorts. Now, didn't you Wearing your, jeans. Yeah. Didn't your dad wear his garment top to go he for did. jogs? He did. He really yeah. did, and uh, now, this, this is in, in Michigan. Michigan. Yeah, people do not know about LDS uh, culture or attire. Yeah, and he, <laughs> he, yeah, he would have a cool down lap, is what he called it, <laughs> and so he would take his shirt off and just walk around with like garment flaps. So he yeah. had like a zip up thing and just go <laughs> and sweat. And, yeah, and while only, we went to school. Yeah, and only you and your brother and sister would know. Yeah, he's like, why does your dad have a belt cape? And we'd be like, it's, I don't know, man. <laughs> anyway, what makes your dad weird? We definitely want to hear from you. 435-674-1051. You could right now. This one is from Nanon. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Nana, Nanon. Okay. Anyway. Hi, Nanon. Hi, Nanon. She says he has 17 Sam's Club shirts. Different colors, same style. It works. Does he work there? That's the good question. I don't know if he works at a Sam's Club. Or I mean, if he just likes the shirt. Or he just really gets them for free because, you know, he's a frequent shopper okay. or something or, like that. Or maybe he works at Costco and he just likes to tick them off. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Could be. He's like, if you're not better to me, this is where I'm going. <laughs> I already got the shirts. Uh, this one is from Mary. Hi, Hi Mary. Mary. He whistles to get our attention. Most mm. of us are in our 40s and still answer to it like dogs. Yeah. This one is from Hannah. Hi, Hi Hannah. Hannah. She says her dad burps when he says the word burp when he burps. Okay. When asked why, he says because it's not a fart. So like that makes like n- complete burp, sense. Burp. Yeah. Or if he says the word burp while burping, I don't know. 
I feel like I need some more information. <laughs> <laughs> this one is from Anne Marie. Hi, Hi Anne. Marie. Anne. Uh, when I would watch movies with friends, he wouldn't sit and watch. He'd only stand eerily in the corner. <laughs> Man, that is creepy. That is so creepy. And I'm guessing they watched one movie and the friends never came back again. <laughs> That's right. Maybe that was his plan. <laughs> yeah. He just forget it. This one is from Louise. Hi, Hi Louise. Louise. He wears black dress socks and floor shine wingtips with his bathing suit. <laughs> Love it. Beautiful. Yeah. We knew a guy who did that. Yeah. Yeah. This one is from Claire. Hi, Hi Claire. Claire. She says he keeps used napkins and paper towels in his pockets in case he needs them again. Okay. I mean, this is kind of like having a hanky. My dad my dad still uses hankies. He does, doesn't he? Yes. Like a cloth one. Yeah. That's it's, so gross. It's, it's better paper and throw it away. Well... Luckily, he doesn't, like, offer it to other people if they yeah. need a tissue Ho or well, something. Well, hopefully not. I have no idea. I don't idea. think he does, but. All right. And then, finally, this one is from Michael. Hi, Hi Michael. Michael. He says he impersonates the Swedish chef when he cooks. Oh, that's cool. Bark, bark, bark. Yeah. Yes, we know what the Swedish chef is. I know. I just Mike. wanted to show you how cool I am. Oh, okay.